when helping others, do so sincerely, from your heart, not expecting anything in return from them. Do it with utmost respect, not in a derogatory way, making them feel small or less in stature. Maintain dignity and self-respect at all times. May the Almighty accept our deeds. Never forget that Satan is a big enemy. He loves it when we are at loggerheads with people. He loves it when there's unrest, fighting, arguing, lots of turmoil everywhere. So protect yourself and do your best not to get drawn into such situations where there is disunity. Suicide is not an option. When you're in the depths of despair, remember, to prolong your prayer and confide in Him. He knows what you're going through. He will never burden you with more than you can bear. Keep your heart firmly at attached to Him. He will find a way out. Don't allow your circumstances to dictate your feelings. When you accept the Almighty's decree fully, you have the right attitude towards difficulties or bad news. You accept there's good in everything eventually. You're able to walk firmly and steadily. You have firm faith in Him. We change many things in our lives, almost on a daily basis. In fact, change is the only constant today. From physical appearance to our jobs, things are changing. So why do we cling on to our thoughts, ideas, notions, perceptions and mindset which serve no purpose? Spreading rumors and gossip is incredibly dangerous. It destroys reputations, breaks down relationships and causes mayhem in someone's life. It's so common today because so many have lost basic decency and wouldn't bat an eyelid mass texting such messages. Be careful. Focus on the right things. Things that matter. Not on other people's lives, their drama, problems and behavior. All that isn't your business. You need to fix what needs fixing in your life. Don't be distracted. Don't compare your life to others. Circumstances are never the same. Some people love to make fun of others and humiliate them in public. They lack social manners and some are plain downright rude. They are perhaps unaware that no one has the right to humiliate or hurt another. Besides, the one humiliated may be closer to the Almighty. Be mindful. Keep reminding yourself that you can't control people's thoughts and actions. You don't have to engage every critic, rebut every point, win every argument or prove them wrong. Let them say what they will. Channel your energy towards more productive things. Don't lose focus.